ways to go. We need to catch Maximus. You in? Yeah. And that. We've got Solomon, we've got Caesar. Yep. Some of the greats. We've got the historical. Oh. Uh, we've got Bible names. Oh. Yeah. Big picks. <laughs> <We've got fortune laughs> all, the, all the great ones from the Bible. <laughs> it's from the Old Testament. <laughs> Never mind, Brian. No, yeah, I won that game. What's your rating? Thank you, thank you. I haven't played in a while, though. Slow games or fast games? It shows. Uh, yes. Yeah. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Come on. Hi, Ethan. Hold on a second. So you're from St. Louis? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Visiting? Um, yeah, I, uh... No. Seven. I actually stopped playing tournaments at like 14. Because of basketball. I like to eventually, though, like try to make a push for master or something like that. It's kind of hard, though. What, to be like a. Because I'm like 2150, so that 50 points is pretty. You say 2200 is a master? Uh, 2000 is an expert. And, and 2200 is a master. Thank you, I'm right here. Do you find that um, the five minute rating is usually in line with the um, the long game? Yeah. It's usually, yeah, I think it's usually pretty close. Yeah, it's rough. Yeah. I mean, that's something I look forward to, but I don't know if it's. Because yeah. I mean, it's just like a struggle from like 18 to like 18 to 1900. Yeah, I was stuck at 18 for like two years, uh, and then I somehow broke up to like 21. Does it work yeah. like in like 100 hertz, right? It works yeah, it's kind of weird. So like certain 100 point uh, barriers are harder. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I thought so. Yeah. I was stuck trying to get up to 1800 for a while and I shot up to like 1900. I was like, yeah, right. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah, Perfect keeping it there is hard. Uh, yeah, yeah. You did great. I am doing great. Thank you. I'm not making sure it's all major. First of all, let's go inside. We're going to. There's a What? Of course, I've got all the moves. I'm just kidding. What? A terrible mistake. Alright, we drive out. Can it tell Mark to stay with that? Because all this guy can't go to the same center at all. Same single center is this. There, Tony. I was going to call him Laputzi, but I thought that was going to call him That's why I play chess. Why aren't there cuddles? Hey, don't call me cuddles. Don't call me cuddles. Don't fondle that. Don't fondle it. Hey. Okay. Hey, Tony. 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 What? I'm, I'm like three moves ahead of you all the time. So what? I need I'm taking the position. Oh.
Fabulous, got a great move coming. Thank you. Thank you. It's too much damn talk. Mike lost? Yeah. 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 Remember, Kai, we go again. You got nothing. I think you should take notes when Kai wins this. You're like, oh, you need to do this, this, and this. What's up? Hey, is Cliff coming? Yeah, it's my big brother. Hey, is uh, Cliff coming? Watch the games, hoping you'll lose. <laughs> That's how you know you're popular. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good job. 
<laughs> Losing. <laughs> Be the most popular yeah. games of all when you beat when you beat Hold the file, Dave. You don't put your book behind Good game, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Still going? I see what's going on now. <laughs> oh dear. I just yeah. let him walk right <laughs> in. There. I just let him walk right in. There. Uh oh. oh. Sack it all, Tony. Sack it all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's an interesting. Yeah. I haven't seen one like that. Just man. let him come in. Hey guys, Brian here, and beautiful trolling by Tony at the end of game one there, man. And uh, Caesar just, that, that night was just too delicious of a bait and Tony set up this mate in case you guys didn't see it it was the following rook check and king over and mate with the rook look at this bishop just supporting the little rook in the corner very very sneaky mate by Tony there very very nicely done man and um, we're gonna go over in the analysis basically uh, how maybe Caesar could have avoided that mate and we'll go over it in the second game exactly what this mate was and what uh, both Noah and Tony saw as well as uh, another tactic for Tony that was missed in the second game as well, but really really fun game by everyone in both man and quick shout out to Tony man I uh, just want to thank him for getting me into bicycling um, I've lost like a lot of weight eight pounds and uh, but it was really really fun and uh, for those of you who don't have a bike I've linked uh, the bike I got to the Amazon there's an Amazon link in the video description so definitely check it out it's one of those cool folding bikes so if you have a small car like I do then you can just stick it in there and go anywhere so it's so really really nice and I'm having a lot of fun biking so thanks Tony for that and um, yeah so if you guys have been enjoying the channel and want to help support it they can become a patron man link is in the video description get a ton of cool stuff check it out interviews Q&A's and a lot more and um, Amazon Lee Suchesky and the bike that I mentioned are there as well alright let's go to game two and let's go all the way back here and Noah setting up um, Noah with these two knights and in the game rook c2 was played and then in the game Tony doubled up I'm just gonna move back will be another move for black here yes bishop takes knight and if knight takes then rook takes yes so um, the, yeah whenever you have these two knights like this it's always um, potential because they're guarding each other so if you if one is being attacked then you can remove the defender and it can be attacked like what happened here a little bit later on with b6 so a little bit tricky there you gotta watch out for when the knights are supporting each other but let's fast forward to the end and um, oh man this bishop move I'll show you why this is so devastating because in the game f6 was played and uh, basically Tony and I mean Noah and Tony both saw what was coming uh, for those who all right, so let's go through the variations. If king f8, then rook or queen check and king e8 and mate. So you see why this bishop move was so devastating. It's like a self mate. It took away. It occupied the escape square for the queen for the king. So ouch, that hurt. And going here, if a g6, then simply queen h6, and you cut off the diagonal, cut off the escape uh, route for the king, and then this is mate. This is um. This mate is coming next so basically you're forced to trade off the Queens and you'll escape but obviously I mean white is winning here and going here I mean the only way to delay it I mean is to uh, like I said at the end is just sack everything but of course um, easy pickings for white there but yeah oof, man I'm telling you man if you're up a piece never give up never surrender and you just might come out with something like this and all the stars aligned here that was that yeah that was the self mate right there remember the bishop if Tony did not move the bishop there we, we would have been fine but uh, just one of those things that happens and um, I always forget who said it but the hardest game to win is one game and Napoleon said that the greatest danger comes the moment before victory so that is uh such as blitz such as chess but really really fun game by all hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you thought in the comments below don't forget to like share comment and subscribe hit the notification and thanks i'll see you guys tomorrow